Welcome back to the No RBA tutorial. In this video, we're gonna go over Click Clock Wood. So let's go. Either walk off. Don't go. Don't be in Talent Trap. Just leave without Talent Trap. From this way, tilt the joystick a bit left. Right when you exit, then aim for this when the camera turns. Aim for the top part of the loading zone. If you didn't do TDC early, then you would have gotten the. Then you would have hit the Witch Switch in RBB, and then you would need to get that piggy all the way here. I'm just showing this because there's movement afterward. Surface here, jump flutter, roll into the jiggy, and roll down left, jump flutter, and you would jump flutter on this. If you did, if you did TDC early, then you wouldn't need to do that. So you would surface here, jump here, jump here, backflip, jump flutter, right when Banjo's feet touches the ground, into the thing, into the night door. Run into this and get in talent shot in the loading zone. So here, just hug this wall, all this way, jump over this one, turn here, then hug this wall. If you do it smoother, then you won't get hit at the last one there. Uh, if you don't get the talent shot in the loading zone, and you have to talent shot within like this area, then you have to jump over the first whip crack. Jump over the first whip crack, whip crack but still hug the left wall. So now for leaf jump, you don't have to do this if you don't want to. You could just go over there, backflip up, and go all the way around and hit the switch. It's just a bit slower. With a leaf jump, you would come out here. You see this little black line right here, this little black mark. That's the visual cue. Then, like, right on it, right there, right about. Backflip straight down. Oh, I missed. You're supposed to go a bit higher on it. Be, like, on it. Backflip straight down. That can happen sometimes, and it sucks. <laughs> Either mash A or time your A button for a bit after, uh, like a second after, it doesn't really matter. Uh, so now, this movement, I want to backflip straight down again. And there's two different movements I see. There's the fastest method, which is get in talent trot right away, then do one jump down left, then up left, then jump up and switch to right. That's the fastest method, and it looks like this. Down left, up left, jump up, switch to right, and you continue on here. And this next method, it's what I used to do as a beginner. Uh, it's actually pretty fast still. It loses just a tiny bit of time, but it's safer. Uh, you leaf jump, normally. Alright, that sucked. Hold on a second. Alright, okay. So what you're gonna do is hold, not don't hold Z. Uh, right when you land, right when you backflip, you're gonna hold straight down. Then you're gonna mash A while holding down left. Then you're gonna get in talent trot, and the camera's gonna be turning while you're getting in talent trot. And you're gonna jump all the way here. Jump peck this. Uh, jump peak bust. I mean. Now we're just gonna do. Uh, I'm just gonna open the layer, open the level, I mean. Normally you shouldn't need this gold feather. You should just slide into this cutscene. Then you just roll hop into this. And hold straight down, get in talent draw, jump. Try and slide on the lip of this. If you can. And jump out. Right away, jump flutter. Talent shot changes the camera three times. One, two, three, jumps. Quick dive. Just, it just barely hit the edge of that um, platform there. Then walk off. Just jump flutter, roll, jump flutter. Then, if you can, just don't take time with this. But if you can, walk in between these two like little bumps into this little middle part. So you can sort of walk onto the middle right away. I don't have enough jiggies just because of everdrive or whatever. I'm on the Everdrive, so it's whatever. Uh, so what you do now is just get in Talent Trot, full jump down left. Sorry, down right. And just swim all the way here. Surface right here. You really want to try and surface right after the fast part of the stroke. Jump flutter here, just like before. And go in. One jump up left, then up right. Jump, jump. Two baby hops are nice. Sometimes that guy can be in the way and it sucks, but whatever. The talent shot. 
go all the way up. I like to zoom out, doesn't really matter. Do big jumps up this slope. Oops. Don't slide, then enter then enter the clockwood. I'm just gonna quickly enter from the menu. 20%. Yeah, okay. How much health do I have? Okay, yeah, never mind. So now we do get in talent trap, big jump here, small jump, peck jump, peak quest, get in talent trap right when you enter. Recoil forward. Then you're gonna jump forward and aim for right between those two trees to get that note. Slide down here, jump, slide, jump in here. Now we only visit spring one one time, so we're gonna turn here right away. Now we're gonna do a big jump, jump flutter, jump flutter, a quick one, jump flutter up here. At these corners, right when you touch the first note, do a small jump, just tap A and slide for the next two notes. Come over here, jump, slide under this bird. It's really easy, or you can jump around it, or you can just wait if you want. Come over here, cut this corner. Big jump up here, get these three notes, jump all the way here. Don't jump right away, wait till you slide a bit and then jump. Otherwise, if you jump right away, you can take frame perfect fall damage accidentally. Get these four notes and go over here. I like to use this small black dot right here as a visual cue. I don't know if you can see it. Take a peck here and roll backflip. Now, if you can flutter cancel, it's fastest to flutter cancel out of the backflip. But if you can't, then just get in talent chart right away and jump up. Over here, right at the edge, do a big jump over this guy. Or you can just jump around him, like here. And we're gonna jump over here, slide down this, jump, slide for this second note, and jump back to change direction, and change your camera while you're jumping back. So it looks like this. I missed it, but it's fine, just like that. Now you're gonna change your camera like this, sort of, while you're going up. I like to make this part right here, this little uh, line here, straight forward when I'm going up. This is just my setup for jumping around the birds. If you don't want to jump around the birds, so then just wait. It's not that hard to go around like this. It's really just as straightforward as that. Just follow what I do with my camera there for my setup. Peck here, jump. Hold Z at this point so you don't accidentally beak bust. You flutter and, and get in talent trap. Run, jump here, jump here, jump here. If you don't want to, if you're not comfortable with talent drop jumps, then you can just roll flutter for the entire part there. Jump here, and then jump before you change the camera. Jump like this, cut the corner here, peck out of your talent drop, kill the guy if he's in the way. If he's really far away, then don't kill him. But if he's right in front of you, then kill him. What I would recommend is not killing him by jumping out of talent drop. I'd recommend pecking out of talent trap, then jumping to kill him. Just because you have more momentum and he won't, there'll be left. There'll, there will be less of a chance that he'll hit you. Now, if you have enough gold feathers, you can gold feather down like this. Let go of Z around here. If you don't have enough gold feathers, then just beat bust recoil down. Get in talent trap. Zoom out. See that this guy's not in the way. Then zoom in. Hold straight down and leave. Now get these two notes, walk for this first one, jump for the second. And go all the way here. Into summer. Summer, summer, summer. Summer is a nice level. Beginning is the hardest part. Zoom out the camera, go around the sky. Quickest way to get up this first leaf is to like do a jump around here and peck up. That's kind of hard and not super consistent, at least not for me. So personally what I like to do is I just like to peck out of my talent and backflip. And backflip straight right. Now, if you want to do the backflip to go on the left of this bird, then you change the camera here. Wait for the full animation of the backflip to stop. Change the direction of Banjo a bit. And backflip straight forward. Walk a bit, then get in Talent Trap. And continue on. If you don't want to do that, then just backflip up here. Backflip here. Backflip straight up right. Get, change the camera. Get in Talent Trap. Either wait for him or jump around him. And continue on. My setup for going jumping around the birds here is the same as in spring. So either do that or just wait for the birds. This one's a little harder. Jump for this note, jump on the third note, slide back, hold R as you jump towards the alcove. Echo here. Jump. Do the same thing as spring. 
exact same thing here. Jump here, except now you go over here, get these four notes. Jump here, jump here, hold straight down left. Oops, I'm gonna pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> come here. Straight down left, big jump, change the camera. Flutter, take fall damage. Flutter, roll, jump flutter, roll, jump flutter, and be quest this. Now you're gonna walk off the switch before you get in talent trot so the bird doesn't snap you. This. And you're gonna go all the way here. You'll be straight, you'll just be going in a straight line for this. Zoom out, turn the camera once. Now, if you have enough gold feathers, um, then you can jump on this, then peck, then gold feather. If not, then peck down here, jump against the side, and then beat bust. Mash C left and Z, hold Z. Go in here, get the two notes, turn back once you hear you get the last note, and go. Take the straightest line towards the exit, which means that you have to go on the back side of this. So this snare bear, all the snare bears in this game, you uh, stand behind the eyes, you won't get hit. So that's why I can do this, not get hit at all. Yeah, just do that, take the straightest line possible, and exit somewhere. Jump down right, change the camera, and go here. Now it's fall time. Fall is a really short level, not too difficult. So, right away, I'm gonna go here. I like to zoom out here, this level lags a lot, but it's not a huge deal. I don't do much to suppress the lag, but the game speeds up with lag to compensate, so it doesn't really lose much time at all, if any. So jump up here. I like to turn my camera once, jump here, slide on the note, and jump in between that note and uh, the little platform, slide to this. Now I like to do my bird jumps like this. Wait, let me wait for it again. I like to do them like this, sort of like that, where... You sort of jump into the bird, then you hold back, then you slide forward after it goes back in. I do this so I can keep my momentum, and I can keep my slide, and I can slide for the note and jump right after. It looks like this. I do that for all the birds that are here. Oops, that's a mistake. Fine. Ignore that, it's fine. Now you want your camera to be like sort of straight here. You get this note. Now what you're gonna do here is you're gonna go right at the edge of this uh, wall, not the wall, the platform, and while the bird is going in, you're gonna jump straight for the note, and then you're gonna switch to right for just a split second, and then you're gonna switch to down, and then land on the platform right to the right of us. Like that. One, two jumps, peck, gold feather, jump here, it's so now Ideally, you would enter fall with 4 health, so what you would do is get all the notes, then damage, get take damage there. 3 health is fine, because it's the same thing. You're just prepping for the death warp. If you want to be more safe, then you might just want to not do this damage right here. Then you jump all the way here. You want to jump from this corner, this very corner right here. And just get these notes. Jump across, aim for this pile, you need the last note here, and do the same more bird jumps. Safe way to do this is to do a big jump, then land, then go forward. Another way to do this is to, let me wait for a bit, just land beside him, then go into it. Either way, with that note, go over here, peck beside him, just around here, just be careful. Don't go too close, just peck beside him. And now Gold Feather, jump into him, jump up, and die. And let's click Clockwood. And you would get in Talent Trot and leave the level. Alright, I'll see you in the next video.